So now for some of the questions <coughs> for our panelists. What do you gain by talking with colleagues? <laughs> okay. my, the word that comes to mind for me is confidence. Yeah, I think I think we all know if you've only if you've been the, the new teacher in this school and you feel like an island, and it's not until you open up those avenues of discussion that uh, you realize the benefit in in more minds uh, coming together on a, on a project. And it's just everybody knows about a discussion when you bounce ideas off somebody else. It just it makes everything better. Or you say, hey, this didn't work. Give an idea how I can improve this. And when Chris spoke this morning about dialogue being one of the big factors in sort of the feelings of success, I just think we have to keep those those dialogues open because it just it builds everybody's confidence, everybody gets better ideas, nobody feels isolated. And even that person who doesn't want to try the new stuff, if you can encourage them to you know step out of your comfort zone and try it and then have a dialogue about how that went, I think you'll see everybody's teaching style change for the better. I think it's the same with, uh, with this conference. Uh, for the two years that we've been in this project, every time we've met as the nine or ten school boards, we, there's always been opportunities where the school boards would meet with each other and basically share ideas and stuff. And it's the same thing within the math department. You know, when you have that time to sit down and, you know, maybe somebody has an idea about doing something different for the thing that we've done the same way forever, never really had the best results, you know, you know teaching algebra or whatever. Uh, by having that con those conversations, you're open to new possibilities, new ways of doing things that uh, benefit the students. What helps to facilitate the dialogue? Time. Number one, time. Uh, unfortunately, with this project, we um, that was available to us uh, as far as resources go. Um, I think that's going to be a hot topic in your Bannery sessions, especially with your admin, moving forward. Uh, hopefully, there will be some opportunities with uh, our new initiative coming forward this year. So hopefully, um, we'll be able to have some resources allocated in that direction because I think time is, is essential. So you know, having the periodic informal conversations and dialogue within the department was valuable. You know, in the hall, in the math department, but having the time, the full day meetings, or whatever that may look like for you moving forward is essential. Julie's an administrator, so I'll just say it in plain words ask for money. <laughs> <laughs> Some of you may there'll, there'll be money available to get time to do things. And, and that's, we all have fantastic ideas of what to bounce off everybody, but we all know it's the time to sit down. It's onerous to change something you've been doing for so long. And we did it almost task by task. And we would sometimes spend a half a day creating one or two lessons, and and we don't have time in our regular day to do that. So if you can get the time from your administrators, it is well worth it. You will you will really be, you'll benefit from it. So you said you had monthly full day. We did. We were allowed that with this project. We were given month. We were given one meeting a month, and and as I say, like if we didn't have that, we wouldn't have had the success that we had because everybody knows you know at the end of the day you're, you're not going to dive into something trying to create something new as well as you would if you have the time. That was my second part so you feel that it, that it should be a full day a full release can you do it in a half or? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. We got a lot of things like at, at the end of the day sometimes we would look back and say gee it doesn't feel like we got a lot done but then when Jay would read the minutes of the meeting the next time we were like holy smokes we did get a number of things done, a number of lessons done, a number of problems solved, you know, the next step. So a half day would be fantastic. Yeah, I think it's totally situational, right? It depends on what your goal, your specific goals are for your department and where you are at that point. 